Okay, so um, uh, I'm going to be discussing in this one gratitude and also um, along the same lines, forgiveness. Um, so um, what I'm uh, talking about here is that, um, you know, uh, some people I would seen in my office and they had a lot of emotional problems um, for whatever the reason uh, or another. Maybe they had depression problems, um, dealing with some stressful event in their lives. And um, it was pretty much tying them up. Um, and they might be coming in um, to uh, ask about getting an antidepressant problem or um, maybe coming into the office and, you know, um, even though they were there for some medical issue, they started talking about, you know, that that damn boss, that damn wife, that damn this, damn that. Um, and, you know, the whole thing was that um, they were unable to cope with a certain situation. With, you know, forgiveness and gratitude, um, which are, you know, kind of very similar, um, uh, here, the whole idea is to um, kind of step outside of whatever the problems are. Um, and kind of look at what's going on with your life and being grateful for what you have. In other words, instead of saying, oh, I want to have this expensive car, I want to be a millionaire, you try to be grateful for what you do have. You know, on our, uh, um, our celebration on Thanksgiving Day, um, it, you know, one of the things was that we're supposed to tell everybody what we're grateful for or thankful for. Um, uh, I don't know that we do that uh, too much uh, anymore these days. We're too busy eating turkey. Um, but yeah, that's that's kind of how it uh, probably all started was um, uh, thank, being thankful for um, what they had received. Um, you know, as uh, the, the, the um, early people came here and um, were thankful that they were still alive, you know. <laughs> um, in addition, the other part of this, like I mentioned, is forgiveness. Um, uh, forgiveness of yourself is important. Um, many times um, we um, uh, kind of uh, put ourselves down or um, say, oh, I wish I had this, I wish I had that. You know, I'm not perfect, you know, because of this. And, you know, along with being grateful for what you have, it's forgiving yourself for any faults that you see of yourself. Um, uh, so, uh, you know, kind of the, along the same line, if you're saying, you know, oh, I'm not a, I'm not a uh, good enough uh, artist, let's just say. Well, be thankful, you know, or grateful for how, how good an artist that you are. Um, uh, you know, I mean, um, uh, you know, uh, I've been a runner for many years and um, I could easily say I'm not a good runner because I can compare myself to the guys who win the races. Um, but I could also compare myself to somebody else um, and, and realize that maybe I'm not such a bad runner. Um, uh, I am 71 years of age and I run so slow people can walk faster than I can run. Um, but again, you know, I am, you know, 71 and still running after 40 some years. Um, so, you know, that, that's something to, to be grateful for. Um, uh, you know, instead of putting myself down and saying I'm, I'm a terrible runner, um, forgive myself, be grateful for what you have. You know, this will you know, really take care of a lot of, um, you know, emotional problems and issues that people have. Um, you know, um, uh, I think also, you know, with the forgiveness thing is forgiving other people too. Um, you know, um, if you're always uh, judging, you know, um, another person, um, um, that causes stress in your own life. Um, you know, um, uh, you know, people have a uh, question why um, uh, Jesus, when he was on earth, said, turn the other cheek and let them hit the other side, too. Part of it is that um, you don't want to become involved in the anger of the other person. Um, uh, you know, and, you know, just realizing that you can tolerate some of these slight faults. So if somebody puts you down, 
Um, and you can feel down or you can just feel, oh, okay, that's, that's fine. You know, I mean, I'm sorry you feel that way, you know. <laughs> You know, forgive the other person for the fact that they put you down. Um, and you're going to be a lot more happy. Um, then if you hold anger towards that person, uh, it's hard to, to be angry. Um, it takes a lot more um, energy to be angry than to be forgiveful. Um, you know, uh, uh, so, you know, you're going to be happy yourself if you're not angry at uh, people all the time. Um, oh. You know, some of these things that I'm uh, mentioning in this uh, video are ways of coping with, uh, you know, stressful situations with, um, you know, uh, difficulties in life. So um, keep it in mind. Um, maybe it'll help. I hope so.